Morning. This is a sabotage spawn trap on Dome. All right, guys, what is up? And today I'm bringing you guys a double Moab gameplay. And you're like, wow, Chris, uh, wasn't that one of your goals for Modern Warfare 3 that you said a while ago? If you guys didn't remember, um, or if you guys didn't know, because you're new subscribers, um, keep in mind I've gained about 40 subscribers in like the past two days, and that is absolutely uh, shocking to me, considering um, you know how long it's taken me to uh, gain subscribers just because. Uh, uh, how small my channel is, but I actually got a shout out from Nero Cinema, and I got a, sh a little a little mini shout out from uh, Wings of Redemption too. So I gained about 40 subs in the past uh, two days, which is you know awesome. I'm really glad about that. So if you guys are from either Nero or Wings uh, Wings's channel, um, thank you guys. Appreciate that. So. Um, if you guys are new, because uh, you know there's a lot of new subs watching my videos, uh, I set three goals when Modern Warfare 3 first came out, and my goals were to, uh, well, the first one was to get a 100 kill game in Modern Warfare 3, which I still have not completed. My other one was to get a 50 KD flawless or higher gameplay, so I have to get a game with uh, at least 50 kills. The KD has to be higher than 50, and it has to be flawless. I've obtained that. And a double Moab. I actually have not been able to get a double Moab yet. This is my first double Moab. Um, I'm not quite sure to actually if I'm going to count it as a double Moab because the way I obtained it. Um, this is really kind of cheap tactic that I used to get the double Moab. Um, I wasn't really going for one. Uh, I was just getting, you know, I just went on two uh, decent streaks while using specialists. So, yeah. So, let me get into what this gameplay is first. This is the first time I've ever done this in Modern Warfare 3, and the first time I've ever done this in Call of Duty, actually. So what this is, is that the game mode Sabotage has six set spawns, well five because you can cut one off. So um, you have five guys that spawn trap, and you have a sixth guy that just runs around the map and waits for some to take someone's spot when they die. So this is what I'm doing during this gameplay, is doing a sabotage spawn trap, and I know some people are going to be like, wow, Chris, I can't believe you actually do this. This is what, you know, those fags do, you know, like, th this is kind of like, you know, abusing the game mechanics. And yes, it is, but this is the very first time I've ever done this. I don't plan on doing this um, probably ever again. Um, I doubt I'll be I'll be doing this even one more time um, throughout Modern Warfare 3, just because I think it's kind of cheap and it's a little bit frowned upon amongst the community. I don't really have that big of a problem with it, but you know I don't want to have a reputation that this is how I you know do good at Call of Duty because uh, I only did this uh, for two games and you know it was fun. Don't get me wrong, it is kind of fun, but um, you know it's not how I want to play Call of Duty. Um, everyone is free to do it, you know how uh, however they want, play it however they want, but. That's not really to my play style. Um, I'm more of a domination guy, and yeah, I just like kind of running around and doing my own thing. So, um, what this kind of does is um, this spawn trap is, you know, they don't really have a chance once you lock them in it, which, you know, kind of sucks, but uh, I'm not quite sure um, if they're ever going to fix this in Call of Duty because I know Black Ops Demolition. It was exactly like this, except for the fact that Sabotage has a respawn timer, so when you die, you have to wait a certain uh, couple of seconds to spawn. That's why I am uh, keep cutting out spots and just showing you every kill I got in the Moab streak itself. It's just to pretty much uh, cut through time, and you know, because there's certain times when they don't spawn in for a little bit because the team left or they're spawning and the other five spawns that are uh, my teammates are covering. And um, I just don't want to show you guys me sitting here ADSing for like, I think this was like a 10 minute gameplay or like a 12 minute gameplay. So uh, I thought I'd just cut it out a little portion of it. So uh, yeah, I'm not quite sure where all the other spots are in the map for this uh, uh, spawn trap because I haven't really done this before. This is the only spot that I know of. So this is uh, what my teammates told me to sit and just aim ADS uh, that little corner area right here in front of me. Um, I have a feeling, you know, some people are going to be like, well, this is why your KD is so high. Um, I, I just have a feeling that there's going to be someone that says that, and uh, it's not true. I've only done this twice and until yesterday, and my KD barely went up considering I have so many kills and deaths. And, uh, you know, this is not how I normally play. I just want to really stress that and get that out there that, you know, I don't do this on the regular basis because some people can be kind of stubborn. And I've had, I've had like, a, 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 I guess you could say my own hater running around my channel. A guy who actually went ahead and made uh, two different accounts to, you know, hate on my channel. And, you know, of course that's going to happen over time. People that don't like you, know, I, I don't really care. You know, it doesn't really get to me or bug me that much at all. So, yeah, you guys can see I pick up my Moab right there. Well, actually, that was my uh, second Moab of the game. So, uh, 
yeah, this is kind of a really, really easy way to boost your KD or, um, you know, get Moabs. I could probably get a quad Moab or, like, a five-man Moab. It really wouldn't be that difficult. All I would need to do is just, you know, uh, wait longer in the game to plant the bomb or, um, you know, just have the right team that doesn't back out. Because we had a team, uh, well, this game only had about two players in it for about five minutes. So it made the game extremely slow. And right around here... Um, my, my teammate died, so I wanted to go take a spot, but uh, I just ended up uh, heading back to my spot. So, um, I've already obtained my double mob. I'm just waiting to call the second one in. Um, the things that I don't really like about this, uh, doing this like little mini sabotage spawn trap, is that I kind of feel bad for the enemy team. Now, some people argue, and I have uh, heard people do this argument, where... Um, you know, the enemy team at the start of the game, they're not spawn trapped at the start, so they have a chance to, you know, fight out and break it, which is true, but once you have them locked down, um, it's kind of not very fair, but uh, I guess, you know, that's the way it is. I'm not going to go Birdman up in here and, you know, do this 24-7 because, you know, it's just not my style. Uh, something I wanted to let you guys know is that I'm ending my Ghost Town series for this week. Um, if you guys are not um, aware of what that is, is that uh, this past Monday when uh, the Modern Warfare 3 weekly leaderboards reset like they do every Monday, I was going to see uh, how high I could get my KD and how high I could get my win-loss. But I'm going to stop it today. Um, well, I haven't done. I didn't do it yesterday, so technically I stopped it yesterday. And that was because I spent a token on double weapon XP and I wanted to level up shotguns and I was doing really bad using shotguns. And uh, the point, the whole point of the series was to play as like defensive as possible, and you know, um, use like the most overpowered guns and stuff like that, and not use shotguns and like snipers like I was doing. And uh, plus, I did this, and I don't want to do this during the Ghost Town series because uh, my KD will be too high. Anyways, guys, the final score is 73 and six. I will have uh, another part of the Black Ops Live come up tomorrow. Peace.